my beloved child, before we begin, I need you to truly take this moment to be still. Listen carefully and stay with me until the very end of this message. I place these words here for purpose, and I want you to feel the depth of my love and the gravity of this moment. This is not just another message. This is something sacred, a moment I want to share with you as if whispering directly into your heart. My beloved child, if your heart seeks God's blessings and you're ready to receive His grace, express your desire by typing yes, I need in the comments. Let your words be a testament to your faith and longing for His divine presence. Today, I want to talk to you about something profound, something that carries both weight and wonder. It's about the concept of a farewell, but not in the way you may think. My child, this is a final farewell, not one of sorrow, but one that calls for your deepest understanding, your fullest attention, and your most open heart. When you hear the word farewell, it often carries a sense of loss, a closing chapter, or a departure. But my beloved, when I say, your final farewell, I am not speaking of abandonment or an end to our relationship. No, this farewell is different. It's a farewell to the things that no longer serve you, a goodbye to the doubts, the fears, and the chains that have held you back. This is your final farewell to the old ways that kept you from truly living. It's time to leave behind the things that no longer align with the beautiful path I have set for you. I am calling you to let go of the weight, the baggage, the thoughts, and the habits that have kept you from being fully who I created you to be. So, as you read this, take a deep breath. Let it out slowly, and with that exhale, Imagine releasing everything that has been holding you down. This is not an end. It's a powerful new beginning. You've been carrying fear for too long. Fear of failure, fear of rejection, fear of the unknown. It has all weighed so heavily on you, hasn't it? And doubt, to doubt that whispers in your ear, making you question your worth, your capabilities, and even my love for you. My child, it's time to say farewell to these burdens. I didn't create you to live a life bound by fear and doubt. I created you to walk in freedom, to move with boldness, and to stand confidently in who you are, my beloved child. Today, I want you to let go of the fear and doubt that have wrapped themselves around your heart. Feel them loosen their grip as you remember that I am with you. Year one. If this message made you feel loved, share a little love back with a light. You are never alone. When fear tries to tell you otherwise, remember that I am the one who walks beside you, behind you, and ahead of you. When doubt tries to creep in, remember that my promises to you are true and unchanging. This is your final farewell to fear and doubt. Let them go and step forward in my strength. I see the pain you've been holding on to, the regrets, the memories of moments you wish you could change. They haunt you sometimes, don't they? You replay them over and over, thinking about what you could have done differently, wondering if things could have turned out better. But my child, you don't have to carry that anymore. This is your final farewell to pain and regret. The past does not define you. It has shaped you, yes, and taught you valuable lessons, but it does not get to hold power over your present or your future. I am the God of redemption. I take what was broken and make it whole. I take what was painful and turn it into something beautiful. Let go of that pain. Release the regrets into my hands. Trust that I can turn every hurt into healing and every misstep into a stepping stone for growth. You are not bound by your past, my child. With me, you are always moving forward, always renewing, always becoming the masterpiece I intended. Your heart has been heavy with worries. You worry about tomorrow, about the next steps, about things that may never even happen. I see how it burdens you, how it takes away the peace and joy that I long for you to have. My child, 
it's time to say farewell to worry and anxiety. I didn't create you to live a life overwhelmed by worry. I created you to live in peace, knowing that I am in control, that I am your provider, your protector, and your guide. I know it's not always easy, especially when life feels uncertain, but I want you to remember this. You don't have to carry the weight of the world on your shoulders. Take a moment to breathe deeply. As you exhale, imagine releasing the worries that have tangled themselves around your heart. Let them go and let my peace wash over you. I am taking care of you, my child. I am working in ways you cannot see, and I am already in your tomorrow. This is your final farewell to worry and anxiety. Trust me with what's to come and allow yourself to rest. There have been moments when you felt unworthy, haven't there? Moments when you've questioned whether you are enough, whether you deserve love, kindness, or success. Those moments hurt me too because I see you for who you truly are. My child, it's time to say farewell to feelings of unworthiness. You are my treasured creation, fearfully and wonderfully made. Your worth doesn't come for what you do, what you have, or what others think of you. Your worth comes from me, the one who created you, who knows you intimately, and who loves you unconditionally. You are enough because I say you are. Let go of the lies that have whispered otherwise. Say farewell to the thoughts that tell you you're not good enough, smart enough, or strong enough. In my eyes, you are perfect and you are cherished beyond measure. Hold on to the truth and let it fill your heart with the confidence and peace you deserve. Dear wonderful supporter, your super thanks donations play a crucial role in helping us share spiritual insights and inspire hope globally. With every contribution, you're helping light the way for countless others. Tap the super thanks button to join us in creating positive change. I know you've been carrying guilt and shame for things in your past, choices you wish you hadn't made, or moments you're not proud of. I see the weight it has on you, how it keeps you from fully embracing the love and joy I have for you. But today, I'm asking you to say farewell to guilt and shame. I am the God who forgives, who wipes away every tear and every stain. When you come to me seeking forgiveness, know that I give it freely. Your sins are cast as far as the east is from the west, never to be remembered again. If I, your creator, have forgiven you, then it's time for you to forgive yourself too. Release the guilt and shame, my child. It no longer has a place in your life. Let it be replaced with my grace, my mercy, and the knowledge that you are redeemed. You are not defined by your past mistakes, but by the love I have for you and the future I am leading you into. I know there have been times when you felt alone, even in a crowded room. Times when you felt like no one understood you, no one truly saw you. But you were never alone, not even for a moment. My beloved, it's time to say farewell to loneliness. I am always with you. I am closer than your breath, more constant than the rising sun. I have walked beside you through every valley, stood with you in every storm, and celebrated with you in every victory. Even when you couldn't feel me, I was there, holding you and loving you with a love that never fades. So, say farewell to the loneliness that has whispered lies to you. Let my presence fill the spaces in your heart that have felt empty. You are never alone, my child, and you never will be. I am here now and always, wrapping you in my everlasting love. You've looked around and seen others with what you don't have, achieving what you haven't, and you felt like you don't measure up. Comparison has stolen your joy, my child, but today, it's time to say farewell to comparison. You were never meant to follow someone else's path. I created you uniquely, with a journey that is yours alone. Your gifts, your strengths, your purpose, it's all part of my perfect design for you. 
What I have planned for you is just as special, just as meaningful, and just as beautiful as anyone else's story. Release the need to compare yourself to others. Embrace who you are, who I created you to be, and trust that you are exactly where you need to be. Your life, with all its moments, is a masterpiece that I am painting with love and intention. You are enough, just as you are. There are moments when you've isolated yourself, either out of pain, fear, or the belief that no one would understand what you're going through. But my beloved, you were not made to go through life alone. It's time to say farewell to isolation. Beloved, as you absorb the inspiration from this video, consider sharing it with up to three individuals who might need a gentle nudge or a heartfelt boost. Together, we can make a meaningful impact by simply sharing a bit of encouragement. I have placed people in your life for a reason. I have given you a community, even if it doesn't always feel perfect, to support you, love you, and walk with you. And above all, I am your constant companion. You are never truly isolated, because I am with you, encouraging you to reach out, to connect, and to find joy in relationships. Let go of the walls you've built around your heart. Open yourself to connection, to love, and to the beauty of sharing your life with others. You are not alone, and you don't have to face anything alone ever again. This farewell is not an end. It's an invitation. An invitation to freedom, to peace, to a life full of my love and joy. You don't have to hold on to the things that have weighed you down. You don't have to live in the shadows of what was. Today, I am calling you to step into the light, into the truth, into the fullness of life that I have for you. Your final farewell is the beginning of something beautiful. It's a farewell to everything that has tried to hold you back and a welcome to everything that will lift you up. It's your chance to embrace the life I designed for you, a life overflowing with love, peace, and purpose. So, take the step, my child. Say farewell to what was, and welcome what is to come. I am with you, now and always, guiding you, loving you, and finding joy in you every day. My beloved, remember this as you go forward. You are my everlasting joy. No farewell will ever separate you from my love. No past mistake will overshadow my plans for your future, and no fear will ever break the bond we share. Listen carefully to this truth, hold it close, and remember that with every step you take, I am with you. You are loved, cherished, and my joy forever. My beloved child, let this message of hope and encouragement reach beyond you. Share this video with someone who may be in need of a reminder that they are not alone and can find strength again. Amen.